The biggest moment from last night's Billboard Music Awards, Michael Jackson taking the stage in virtual form. The technology wowing the audience. And ABC's Rachel Smith is in Las Vegas to tell us about how that magic happened. Rachel. Good morning, Lara. I witnessed a slice of history last night at the Billboard Music Awards right here at the MGM Grand Arena in Las Vegas. The late Michael Jackson center stage was definitely the most talked about performance of the night. He was a dancing machine. The king of pop brought back to life at Sunday's Billboard Music Awards in a groundbreaking multi-dimensional performance of Slave to the Rhythm, a track off his new chart-topping posthumous album, Escape. MJ alongside 16 live dancers on stage and in the aisles, twisting, and of course, moonwalking, moving some to tears and bringing the crowd to its feet. Jackson's brother Jackie, the only member of the Jackson family in the audience. It's like he was right here with us. I got teary-eyed a little bit just to see my brother up there. I thought he was there for real. It sent chills down my spine. Those one-of-a-kind, shake-your-body-down-to-the-ground moves, reminiscent of the real Michael, taking a team of more than 100 dancers, performers, and crew over a year to create the history-making number. I think he feels all the hard, hard work that we put behind it. Mm -hmm. And he's definitely in spirit here tonight. Exactly how they did it is for now a tightly held secret. Just how those who knew Jackson say he would have wanted it. But Jackson's estate did tell us it was not an impersonator nor a hologram like the one used to resurrect rapper Tupac Shakur at the 2012 Coachella Music Festival. What is happening tonight? Well, it's magic. I think that's the best way to explain it. It's Michael magic. They say it was something even newer and more revolutionary and that some of its creators also worked on visually groundbreaking films like Avatar and The Curious Case of Benjamin Button. But it almost didn't happen. Two companies with rights to hologram technology tried to pull the curtain on Jackson's return. The court quickly striking down the lawsuit, allowing the show to go on. And go on it did. Michael back on stage and history made. You just couldn't beat it. This performance comes on the heels of the release of the second posthumous album featuring Jackson called Escape, which could become the seventh number one album for the King of Pop. Lara? Oh, what a mystery. Unbelievable. I love that we leave it a mystery. Michael Magic. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> <laughs> it's fitting that it was him. Yep, Michael yeah. Magic. Mm -hmm. Well done yeah. indeed.